Unraveling the Meaning of Water Gap, A Linguistic Journey. Hello, wonderful learners. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that might have trickled into your vocabulary streams, water gap. This term, while not commonly encountered in everyday conversation, holds significant meaning in both natural geography and metaphorical expressions. So, let's flow through the learning together and explore the depths of this phrase. Let's start at the source. The literal meaning of water gap. A water gap is a geographic term. It describes a place where a river or stream cuts through a ridge or mountain range. This happens over a long period of time, as the flowing water erodes the rock, creating a natural passage. In this context, water gap is often used in subjects like geography, geology, and environmental science. When you picture a water gap, think of it as nature's own bridge, carved out by the persistence and power of water. Moving downstream, we come to the metaphorical use of the term. In everyday language, a water gap can symbolize an opening or opportunity that has been created through persistent effort or a natural development over time. For example, someone might say, the new trade policy created a water gap for small businesses to enter the international market. Here, the phrase suggests that an obstacle has been removed, allowing for an easy path forward, much like how a river creates a gap in the mountains. Now that we're familiar with the meanings, let's ensure you're confident in using water gap in conversation or writing. Remember, use it sparingly and in the right context, especially in its metaphorical sense. Ensure the conversation has a clear link to opportunities, breakthroughs, or geographical features to avoid confusion. Pair it with descriptive words for emphasis, like natural water gap for geography or unexpected water gap for opportunities. And that's the confluence of our journey today. The phrase, water gap, has carved its path from geography to the English language, providing us with a rich way to describe certain features and moments of opportunity. I hope this video has helped to bridge any gaps in your understanding, and you now feel ready to use this phrase when the moment flows. Keep learning, keep exploring, and I'll see you in the next video.